Uh, Prime Minister Ardern, Joey Dwyer from News Talk ZB here. Um, yeah, a lot of people will be wondering, are you two meeting just because, you know, you're similar in age and, you know, got a lot of, you know, common stuff there, you know, when you got into politics and stuff, or can Kiwis actually expect to see more deals so between our two countries down the line? Because my there first, is, I mean, My first question is, I wonder whether or not anyone ever asked Barack Obama and John Key if they met because they mm. were of similar age. Uh, we, of course, uh, have... Uh, a higher proportion of men in politics. It, it's reality because two women meet. It's not simply because of their gender. Uh, Finland uh, exports into New Zealand $199 million worth of exports. They have particular technology in companies like Nokia, biofuels, uh, even basic uh, industrial wares that we use in our buildings. You won't be aware that a large number of our elevators come out of Finland agricultural machinery. New Zealand, on the other hand, is trading about $14 million worth, and it's mostly in wine and beef. There is huge potential between us. The EU FTA <laughs> is a launch pad for that, but we need to make sure that as nations we don't just simply go through the motions of an FTA ratification, but that as individual nations we look for the opportunities to build on that economic agreement. So for me, this is timely. Next year we're looking to progress that FTA. Our meeting today is a chance alongside the Prime Minister's high-level trade delegation of significant industry leaders, we really leverage the economic opportunities between our two countries. Little would be known about the depth of that relationship or the potential of it, but it's our job to further it, regardless of our gender. Yeah, we are meeting because we are prime ministers, <laughs> of course. 